Curious about how smart cards work? Let's take a look. Smart cards aren't exactly new, but they continue to revolutionize the way we access and protect our digital assets. Smart cards are not just another form of ID. They are your gateway to a myriad of applications, from logging into your computer to opening doors at your building, all while keeping your identity safe. But how do they work? At the core of smart cards is certificate-based authentication, or CBA, a modern way to authenticate without the need for passwords. Whether it's for federal agencies or your local office, PIV-enabled smart cards are your all-in-one solution for secure access and identity verification. Though they require an external card reader, the unmatched security and convenience they offer make smart cards a key player in the move towards a passwordless future. But how do smart cards compare to other security tokens like YubiKeys? Smart cards are generally more affordable and can grant you physical access to building something most USB tokens like YubiKeys can't do. However, you do need a card reader to use them, and unlike YubiKeys, most smart cards don't support FIDO2, the latest standard for secure authentication. The next question that people ask is, are smart cards hard to set up? While before you needed up to 15 servers for a simple smart card deployment, Thanks to innovations like Entra CBA and Easy CMS, setting up and managing smart cards has never been easier all done securely in the cloud. This means you can say goodbye to the complex setups of the past and hello to seamless, secure access. If you want to learn how to set them up, watch this video on how one of our engineers was able to set everything up and create his first smart card in less than 20 minutes.